long before GPS satellites and other high-tech navigational aids. The compass gave humans an easy and inexpensive way to navigate themselves. A compass is an extremely simple device, consists of a small lightweight magnet balanced on a nearly frictionless pivot point. The magnet is generally called a needle. One end of the needle is often marked N for north or colored in some way to indicate that it points towards north. But what makes a compass work the way it does? If we look at the anatomy of the earth, the center of the earth is known as the core. Then we have the mantle and the main surface is known as the crust. The earth's core consists of molten iron and the pressure inside is so great that iron crystallizes into solid. Convection caused by heat radiating from the core along with the rotation of the earth causes the liquid iron to move into rotational patterns. It is believed that these rotational forces in the liquid iron layer lead to weak magnetic forces around the axis of spin. This forms a magnet-like bar inside the surface of the earth. The south pole of the magnet faces the north pole and the north pole of the magnet faces south pole. As we all know that north and south attract each other and by this way the south part of the needle points the north direction. And that's how a compass has helped in various expeditions around the globe.